Thanks for staying with us, everybody. We got a picture here at News 15 from viewer Lisa Lewis sh showing what looks like a ring around the sun. But what is it? Well, is it a bad omen? Is the sky falling? How does something like this even form? These are tonight's good questions for Storm Track 15 meteorologist Michael Crowley. Take a look at this picture I received from Lisa, a rare optical phenomena that'll make you take a second glance. This is called a sun halo, created when light shines through ice particles and it refracts or bends the light rays. This is similar to how a rainbow forms. Now, cirrus clouds, which are high altitude wispy clouds just like this, they're typically made entirely of ice crystals, which is perfect for creating these sun halos. This usually creates a white, but sometimes faintly colored rainbow sort of circle ring thing, lack of a better term. All you need is geometry and some meteorology to understand how it really works. So here we have the sun rays entering into an ice crystal. In this case, it is a hexagonal prism. The light rays that enter into this prism get bent 22 degrees off of the original trajectory. The light rays are then bent or refracted all across the sky because there are millions of these little prisms all across the sky. So from a certain perspective, you get to see a certain ring of light around the sun or the moon. And with this, an old folk tale usually says a ring around the moon, rain is coming soon, which I wish was true, but it is not. Cirrus clouds usually precede rain clouds. Unfortunately, in our case, no rain is in sight anytime soon. And the next week or so ahead of us appear to be quite dry with high pressure always sitting nearby. I guess we've come a long way since some folk tales. Now, if you want to see a good question of your own answered here on News 15, scan this QR code that you're seeing on your screen right now. That will send you over to my email, mcrowley at kadn.com. I look forward to any good question you have for me, and I'll answer them right here on News 15. I'm still on track 15, meteorologist Michael Crowley, and I can't wait to hear from you.